Hey everyone, it's technology expert Burton Kelso with Integral here, sharing another tech tip to help you get the most out of the technology in your life. Today we're going to talk about a great website and a great app called Road Trippers. It's out there for you travel fans to plan the perfect itinerary and the perfect trip. Uh, with spring break and summer vacation around the corner, it's a great idea to use Road Trip to find that ultimate destination. You can create your own itinerary with Road Trippers, or you can use the pre-selected uh, plans and trips that are available on the website. You can find attractions, you can find hotels, and you can also share your itinerary with your family and friends. We're going to switch screens like we always do and take a look at Road Trippers. Pretty awesome site. Discover, plan, and hit the road. Made for explorers like you and me alike. So when you start your destination, or you can start your starting point. So we'll do Kansas City, Missouri. And then uh, we'll do our destination. Let's say that we want to go to Los Angeles. Once we type in um, our trip, then we can choose what things we want to do. We can look for food and drink. Uh, we can look for camping, which I'm going to uncheck that because I'm not a camper. Um, you can also choose outdoor activities and weird stuff. And I think I would pick weird stuff. But I'm kind of curious. I want to see everything that's involved on the trip. So I want to go ahead and leave it on everything. Once we click on the go button, Road Trippers will do its thing. And after a few seconds, uh, it should show us our destination. So then it gives us the option to edit the trip as well. So let's go ahead and click on edit the route. And then I can create trips with friends too if I wanted to plan. So let's go ahead and get started. And as you can see, um, it shows all the destinations along the route. So if we zoom in on the map and we scroll over, we can see some of the highlights of what it wants us to do on the road trip. Um, let's go back a bit and let's go over to the left hand side and as you can see here uh, it shows me how many miles, so 1600 miles to Los Angeles. Uh, it's going to take roughly about 22 hours and 50 minutes to get from Kansas City to um, Los Angeles. I can uh, go and view the guide so let's go ahead and click on that and uh, it shows our destination. We can add itinerary and text about things that we see. We can see all of the hotels that are listed along the route and you can also see more guides as well. But we're going to go back to our map and look at some of the things that are highlighted on the trip. If we zoom in on the map you can definitely get a better idea of some of the destinations that are around on that trip and it gives you a nice clear map of uh, all the places you're going to see. Uh, so we've crossed Kansas, we've gone into Colorado, and then of course we're going to start to head down south uh, through Nevada, and then we'll finally get to California. Well, I missed a state. There's Colorado, there's Nevada, and then we finally make it to California. But it definitely gives you a guide as far as um, where to go and places to see. Uh, as you can see on the left hand side here, you can invite friends on your trips uh, as well. And then you can customize what things you want on your map. So if you want to get rid of outdoor and recreation, it's going to get rid of all that or you can see exactly what's on there. You can also see hotels, attractions and culture. And of course, if you want to camp, uh, you can see that as well. Going back to the main page of Road Trippers um, after a few seconds. You don't necessarily have to plan a route. Uh, you can go in and look at some of the trips that they have already planned. Uh, presented by KOA Campgrounds, obviously, they want you to go out and um, go camping. But you can also look at bloggers of people and their trips. Uh, and you can see other road trips that are planned that you can click on and take a look at. Uh, you can also... From the website, if we go back to, um, we can do top attractions. So if you wanted to take a road trip to a attraction, you can click on that. 
You can check out hotels and do booking directly from roadtrippers.com. Uh, and then there's also essential information that you may need about specific trips. Uh, but it's a great website, a place you can go to plan that ultimate road trip. Of course, flying is always more convenient, but you don't get to see the great destinations in the United States unless you take a road trip. So if you've never taken a road trip before, I highly recommend you hop in your car and select a destination and go for it. But um, you can also go to Road Trippers and use this awesome website to make the ultimate road trip. Um, there's a lot to see in the United States and some of that stuff you can't see unless you hop in the car and go for a ride. You can use road trippers for um, day trips, but you can also use it for trips across the country too. So um, before you take your next trip, use road trippers. Uh, it's not only a website. Uh, there's also an awesome app for Apple and Android devices. Uh, if you sync your account up, then road trippers will automatically save that information to your smartphone. Uh, as you can see, download from the Google Play Store which we'll click on there and there's the Road Trippers Trip Planner so you'll know what to look for. Close that browser and then you can also download it to the uh, from the Apple Store uh, and Road Trippers Trip Planner is the name of the app. Uh, but once you set up an account all of your information will show up on your smartphone allowing you to view your trip and to check out your destinations from the comfort of your smartphone while you're on the road. So check out this awesome site and I would love to see in the comments section what awesome road trips you've taken. And if you use the road trip app, let me know how it worked for you. As always, if you've got comments or questions, leave them in the comments section below. We'd love to hear from you to find out what tech tips you would like to see in future videos. Speaking of videos, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can either subscribe to Integral. Uh, we help people with their technology. Or you can subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's Burton Kelso. Um, there's hundreds of videos there that are designed to help you get the most from the technology that you use in your home or business. And be sure to follow us on social media. We're on all the social media platforms sharing tips and tricks designed to make you a tech rock star. So as always, folks, take care of yourself and do many things to make you smile. And thanks for watching.